He's a warm one today. Oh, look who arrived. Mick9. It's been all of 10 minutes since he was here. What's up, guys? How's it going? Mark from 408. So, we are having a party this weekend. Track party. Obviously, by the time this video will be up, the party will be over. But So, I'm just trimming up the driveway. Brad's rocking out. Um, yeah, we're just trimming the edge for the big trailers to come in. Obviously, it grows in every year, so I trim it every year, but she keeps growing in. What's that? Hey, hey, feel like I just seen you. <laughs> my working hat. I haven't worn my working hat in a while. I miss it. I've been wearing this little beat up Team LTD one. Since COVID started, she's a little tighter. <laughs> you got a big hat on you? Yeah. Uh, all right. Dallas just ran away. He's getting a sawzall, so. Nice. I figure I'm just gonna do one giant video. This today, maybe jump the van. Today? We're doing uh -huh. a video today? This is a video. That's a video. This is gonna be all one video. And then we're maybe some. All one video. And then some riding tonight with the side by sides. And maybe riding tomorrow with the dirt bikes. And then the party Saturday. So. Nice. Do her all. Do her all. So yeah, we're just gonna trim in this driveway like we do every year. Are you ready to party? We trimmed her up pretty good last year. We did, by the way, every year. Just, I'll swear. help you trim, but I don't think I'm coming Saturday. No. <laughs> You're yeah, just going to have a night in. Yeah, I'm just going to stay in. Maybe drink some tea. I know what you guys are all doing. I'm like, I'm going to just get some rest here. <laughs> it's been a busy week. Uh, I'll probably just take week. it off. Look at this guy. Got the longest blade available. Why don't you just buy a chainsaw? Nice handkerchief. Hey. This is COVID oh, scarf. Right on the source, okay? <laughs> Just where is it? There's something in the bush right there. <laughs> I bet I there's a lot of things it. in there. Heard it. All right, let's start throwing away. Okay. It's probably a cougar. <laughs> How old do you think she is? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to merge here. Let me merge. <laughs> Come on. Oh, these two. I think you guys just gotta believe and let me cut down the street. Hopefully it doesn't land on the highway. Yeah. So you should scale up the tree and take off the top first. <laughs> That's still fun. I'm getting through there. Probably should have used a chainsaw, but I got a sawzall. What's your imagine, opinion? Imagine all you just have to do is just push it. Don't shake it because then all the branches land on your head. <laughs> it's a good time. It hurts. <laughs> oh, we'll you get it. Take your word for it. Yeah, we got all the batteries. All right, I got my rope hooked up. Brad's grabbing a razor. See, if we don't cut it down, it'll die. If we don't kill it, it'll die. It'll fall on the road, so. Might as well take these little ones, too. Oh, God, here comes bad hips. <laughs> ah, yeah, we'll suck the winch up. Boom. We're here. Easy, my windows are open. <laughs> That's perfect, right there. Right into the highway. Maybe we'll hit a car. Wait, this one? Do you reach the road? Nah, you're good. What's that? <laughs> you just gotta believe, Dallas. Dude, just... that thing's not gonna hit me if it comes down. You're good. This thing, no, these ones. These hit the road? Or... Nah. Oh, you're not, you're not gonna hit the road. You're doing this? Yeah, I just wanna film this tree hitting Dallas. <laughs> I love how he pulls it towards him. Yes, Usually, let's go. It's hot. Oh, you got to go You should push it away push from it. you, not I'm towards going you. Down. Push it. Stop it. That's why you don't shake it. He looks right up at it. <laughs> yeah. It's falling. <laughs> Use both hands. Hurry up, we're filming. The people on YouTube are, are waiting we're for you. Film. Yeah, we're running out of film here. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at that. Ah, there you go. Oh, that was exciting. <laughs> you got your parking brake on? I think we should cut up all these posts and use them as firewood. Dallas, stand on this rope, tight rope it. Look at us, a couple of arborists. 
Come on, Razor. Got your brakes on? Yeah, you do whatever you want. <laughs> That's a sturdy tree. <laughs> you need to cut her more. Dallas, where's the saw? I'm <laughs> All right, it's got to come now. Oh, that was a rock star truck back there. Oh, she's wanting it. Should have got a Maverick. <laughs> the struggles. We're not very good at our room. She's wanting it. Oh. He dug a nice little hole for himself. Yank her down! What? Yank her down! Oh, yeah. Oh, this is dragging him. All right, hold on. I'll cut it more. What? I'll cut it more. <laughs> this thing doesn't fall. I just cut like all the way around it. Give her a yank. Throw it in reverse, yank it. Probably should have wore gloves. Kind of burned my hand. How's this thing not falling? <laughs> Do we have to get my truck? <laughs> People driving by are probably laughing at us. Oh! There you go. Whew. Yeah, yeah. Kind of. Yeah, on this side. On this side, it was. We're good. Oh my God! <laughs> Classic. The old workhorse. What is this? Hold on. Let me, I need I need two hands here. Hold on. <laughs> Just gonna take out the old nine one one sign. Classic. <laughs> the old workhorse. You got her in low? That's the old Yankum rope. Let's so see if we can make her back up the ditch. <laughs> She's going. Got her. You're going. Keep Come on. Going. Stay committed. <laughs> Couple of jumpers. We're up on the track. Well, we've been collecting since I think January, so she's good to go. There's three loads of skids in here. Four loads of chopped wood. That's the whole lane we just chopped up. Pushed all the tires back because, well, I'm sure a few of those might roll into the fire, but. You saw a can at me? Did it hit you? It's pretty close. Oh. <laughs> oh. Freaking tossing the garbage. All right, let's go. I thought that's where you wanted the can. Oh, yeah, just over my head. Let's go sit by that river. Yeah, well, watch this one right in the can, boys. Walk away. Oh, that was close. <laughs>
Lewis Grant Pile. We'll clean those up eventually. What a day to be alive. Fart through my hand. This is what we do when we're not jumping cars and having fun. Are you guys are sleeping, we're getting shit done. This is right? the one I get all the air out. Of. You got some air? Right here. Come over today. Your puddle's drying up. The old bush pusher. This stuff is tall. It's taller than the razor. <laughs> we're just beating trail. We're just gonna <laughs> it's somewhere at the end. Hopefully there's no bodies back here. Are you recording? Oh, yeah. Whew, should have brought the suits. Yeah, it is. sat in the river. Oh, it's gonna be perfect for Saturday. Water level will drop a little, she'll settle. It looks clean. You coming up here? Where am I coming? I don't know. Stop, 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 stop. stop Brad. You gotta stay the left. It's coming through. That's the road. That's the road. You're welcome. Wait for us. Oh yeah, this is a big it's drop a here. Hairy there. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's hairy everywhere. This one's nothing compared to the one you had. What an evening. It looks like a freaking golf course down here now. Look at that grass. Isn't that perfect? Bet a lot of people would want to ride here. Anyways, a couple of guys are here. We're heading down to Thrill Island for a quick rip. And we're riding tomorrow and then off to the party this weekend. Late that mother on fire. See this. Throw it in a little bit. Sometimes just gotta fold it in half and beat the walls. Sometimes just gotta make your own trail. It's easier. It's the way of life. I don't think anyone made it behind me though. I need some mirrors. Oh, look what the cat dragged in. Reckon, oh, somebody yeah. somewhere. Jeez, I was with Chris and all of them and all of a sudden they were gone. Where'd they go? Well, I crossed the river right at the path there and they uh -huh. couldn't get through the ice ruts. Jay's ready to go. All of a sudden, I realize he has no fuel. You know the number one rule when you go side by siding is fill up. Yeah. So before. He's up there, and he's like, "I'll catch up to you. We haven't seen him." <laughs> nice. Jeez, 20 minutes later, they show up. Where were you? Huh? You were right behind me. I've been oh, here for 20 minutes. I had two bales of hay wrapped around my back. Uh, did you lose everybody else? Axle. Where did you go through a farmer's field or something? I followed you. Look at the stance on this thing, eh? Looks cross-eyed. Like it's been riding a horse its whole life. It's <laughs> yeah. a little bow legged. <laughs> one eye's looking I at you, one eye's looking for you. What are you talking about? You uh. and your machine. Sorry. <laughs> 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 uh. I hear him. Just blew a belt in the road, so we gotta break this belt in. <laughs> Made it! Chainsaw hasn't fallen off yet. I hear him. Ten minutes later. Apparently we got in a death race, so. Took him so long. Oh yeah, finally breaking the belt. <laughs> Didn't lose the chainsaw, so that's that's good. The fish are jumping. Hear them. Over top. Well, he tried. <laughs> Maybe you need a forage clip. He tried. I might want to take you up on your compressor. Okay, I'm going to back up though. Okay. What a night. Look at this, gents. Whew. Whew. Back at the
the compound. New day. Just clean the air filter, tighten the chain. This is what the Maverick looks like from last night. Apparently, I got a little muddy. So we're just going to head out riding. Dallas and I, beauty day. This is my blister from last night from the Sawzall. Didn't know that was a thing. You could get them from the Sawzall. But apparently, the other crew is coming at 1230. Like, it's only Friday, but they're... They're starting the weekend party early, so we'll be down there soon. So we'll start filming. I'm gonna gear up. This is the off-road trailer that my neighbor designed for the Maverick or any side-by-side -side or ATV. So it floats, it's got dirt bike tires on it. It's super light. Um, this is obviously so you can see it. You can fit a ton of stuff in there. There's a tackle box. Yeah, she's quite the unit. I believe, I don't know if it's waterproof, but obviously it floats. Yeah, she just hooks right up. So if any of you guys want one of these, I don't know what the price is, but uh, if any of you want one of these, just DM me and I'll forward you over his contact. So pretty sweet little rig, especially if you're up north camping, you need something to tow behind the Maverick. Obviously you can throw stuff on the back, but if you're camping, you need your coolers, your tents, everything. So anyways, let's head down, take this thing for a rip. I will not complain about this weather this week. It was nice on the weekend. It rained all weekend. So we got some moisture. The grass is kind of greenish again. She was pretty brown up at the farm. It's always green down here because it's just weeds. But uh, yeah, ready for the partay this weekend. Are you ready to partay? I'm ready to partay. Some partaking and some partying? Yes, sir. So I think we got, I want to say 30 to 50 people coming, about 12 to 14 camper trailers and tents. And that'll be our biggest little, our biggest little rager yet. That's our, our pile of wood goodness that we're going to burn. And some tires that hopefully will not get burnt, but you never will. Never will know. So. We got the bikes out today. Ty's on his way down to this trailer. I think they're going to start partying today or camping. I'm guessing they took the day off work. Those concrete workers, they work hard, so they can take the day off. But uh, yeah, I'm excited. Fresh air filter, tighten chain. You want to do some motos? Throw down hard again? I'm going to try. I got a giant blister on my hand, so these will probably be pretty bloody by the end. I got the advantage. You got the advantage. Hey, one side adrenaline's going. I don't feel anything anyway. Jeez, you look like a road worker with <laughs> <We're insane. laughs> Call instruction. These are my new detour goggles as well. If you guys have not seen these, they're pretty awesome. They make they were making snowboard goggles, and I said you guys should make moto goggles, so they did. So it's got interchangeable straps. I got like 10 straps for them. And the best part is the lenses are magnetic. Look at this. Boom. See? So if you're riding and it gets dark out and you need to put clear lenses in. Up. that's how easy they go in so check them out detour sunglasses and dallas's feet well you told me 12 30 but it's 12 on the dot party has started should we just camp out here tonight too <laughs> oh, that is funny look at the rig i imagine he's probably gonna post up right here this is where i usually post up that's his campfire from last time oh willie's here the gate opener Look at this thing. Now that's living in the luxury life. Got the AC and Pink Whitney. That's all you need in there. <laughs> <laughs> the mega rig. Hey yo! <laughs> the old Thunderbolt. This thing is awesome. It's got a garage in the back, sleeper in the front, full kitchen. She's a pretty rig. We're already overriding. <laughs> Taking the kids for a ride. Yeah, you can jump it. Better than the PlayStation. <laughs> so Mark's got a party going in the river. It's like a river party. He's got his friends camped over here, all his motocross and ATV friends. 
And here it is. Here's the party. We got an issue. We're blocking the river. We got a yacker. <laughs> oh, I think it's Chris Johnson. Oh, screen off. Hold on. Oh, you're in it. Oh, shit. Give me that oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. I know. It's dirty. Sorry. Yeah, now we're better. Are you doing video? Yes. What are you doing? Don't, don't, you just focused in on shit. Oh my I'm gonna God, focus this shit. Everybody. Yes. What are you gonna focus on? I don't know what you focus on. Is it recording? It is. Probably too close here. We might be too close. It's not a big deal though. It's no, this is deal. covered in deep. We're fine. Just go like this. What do you smell? A heavy Fresh dose air. of diesel. Fresh air. We should back you know up. No, we're good. We should back no, up. No, we're fine. Here we go. No, they haven't done that. Go on. Back up. Let's back up. Back I, up. I want to be back close. Up. Come on, back, back here. Oh, really? Bad. You think wide angle is the best way? No, like if it's on two times is the best. Well, fuck. Such a bad boy. There you go. Two times is huge. I say this isn't as dramatic as I thought it was gonna be. What's your opinion? Okay, it's good. It's good. It's gonna get real. Okay, check this out, Mark. Look at that. That's huge. Ooh, look at that fire. It's huge over there. Let me just go back a bit. You can even see it reflecting on the river a little bit. Or on the rail there. Whew, couple days later, back at the compound. She is cleaned up, thank God. I haven't been here since actually Sunday morning. It would, uh, we woke up and it was storming sideways. Uh, Taylor's awning blew off. Um, yeah, a lot of people got stuck uh, with their trailers, but all in all, she was quite the party. So I'm glad it, cl it got cleaned up. I cleaned up a bit, but uh, I was hurting, so I went home. So look at this fire. It's still smoking and it's Tuesday afternoon. That is wild. I see someone threw some tires in here. That's pretty, uh, pretty standard. There's one right there. Oh my God. I'm glad all those didn't get lit up, but she was quite the fire. So anyways, that was a awesome weekend. Busy few days for us, you know, just prepping and everything that was going on. So I'm glad everyone that came out had fun. I'm glad you guys enjoyed the video. The fire, I swear it was as high as that tree. Like it was ridiculous. Like we were standing on top of the freestyle landing and it was towering over us. So we got a busy weekend ahead of us. No real big plans this week, just kind of working and laying low. But uh, Saturday, we're headed up to Muskoka to do some ATVing. I think there's gonna be like 100 ATVs or something and side-by-sides. Don't quote me on that, but I know there's gonna be a few. And then Sunday, we're going to Sean's house and uh, I think he said he's got about 20 cars that need destroyed. Obviously, we're not gonna destroy all of them, but we're gonna have some fun. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you like my haircut that I cut yesterday. And uh, yeah, have a fantastic week and weekend. And uh, don't do anything we wouldn't do. We'll see you guys later.